Businesses nationwide are beginning a cashless trend, accepting only credit, debit, and mobile forms of payment. But as Renee Cooper reports, it doesn't seem to be something that will hit North Dakota anytime soon. I would be surprised here in North Dakota if we ever reach that point. I mean, North Dakotas are very conservative and cash has always been king, I think, in the industry up here. Rood suggests it could be a generational trend where millennials and younger carry plastic instead of paper. I asked locals out and about if they carry cash these days. Maybe just for emergencies in case there's some place that does not have a uh, you know, a credit card machine? Just very little. I usually use a credit card most of the time. We usually don't because nowadays, like in every store, they pretty much have all the you know, system to, for us to just pay with debit or credit card. The shift in payment methods suits the one in four Americans who say they don't carry paper money. However, it does exclude the unbanked, those customers who don't have a checking or savings account. People have come through this area that, yeah, they don't bank and they don't things like that. And yeah, you're just excluding a whole group of people. Freilich says having cash as an option makes him feel more secure. The, the network goes out and we're processing cards and it's saving transaction and hopefully it processes when the power comes back on. With cash, you know you have a transaction and you can turn the key on the cash register to open and close it if you need to. Small business owner Carrie Black says she always appreciates when customers pay with cash or even checks. Because I, I'm charged a 2.75% for every transaction on a credit card, so that cuts into my profits. So using cash and checks is just, there's no fees. She says she would not consider going cashless, even in a plastic world. Some people are always going to have cash. You know, you don't spend money that you don't have. So, and I think, you know, that's why cash is so critical yet, I think, to, the, to people in North Dakota. Renee Cooper, KX News. Tomorrow we'll hear from a financial advisor to see his thoughts on whether or not always using a card is actually a smart move in saving your money.